Hi, I'm Dr. Lisa. I love being a vet and doing everything that I can to help animals, people, and our environment. In this video, I'm going to share with you my top tips to help to prevent cancer. Cancer is a relatively common disease that we see these days. It can be really scary, but there are some things that you can do to help to prevent it from rearing its head. Tip number four, wholesome nutrition. As always, this is a vital part of helping to support the body's ability to heal and the immune system to act effectively to help it to identify cancer cells and to stop them in their tracks before it unfolds into a bigger problem. Wholesome nutrition also means avoiding chemicals and preservatives, foreign things in the food, some of which can even act as carcinogens or chemicals that can encourage cancer to rear its head. Tip number five, minimize stress. Stress of any kind can undermine health. It's really important to identify potential stresses and address them as far as possible. Also, consider simple things that you can do to ease stress. Things like flower essence, rescue remedy and emergency essence, essential oils can play a really big role in helping animals to relax. And then of course, various nutraceuticals can be invaluable as well. Tip number six, regular exercise. Regular exercise is so important to help to boost the body's ability to perform and encourage it to act efficiently and boost the immune system. It also provides mental stimulation and helps to promote quality of life. Tip number seven, integrate innovative, common sense and practical things that you can do to boost your pet's health and well-being, help their immune systems and hopefully help to slow down the progression of cancer if it has already been identified. These are things like acupuncture, herbal medicine, kinesiology, even hyperbaric oxygen therapy, which we're so lucky to have at my practice. These can be invaluable, and there are vets around the world who make use of these, integrating the best of both worlds with conventional medicine and complementary therapies. Thank you for watching this video. I hope that these tips have been helpful. Please click like and subscribe and share this information with anybody who can use it. I look forward to sharing more with you next time.